Before using an acoustic camera, everything was based on reaching specific goals of performance levels. But once we started to look how our consumers experience the product, which is ultimately always close to their ears, we noticed how important working on the sound profile of our product is. The Surama Cam comes in handy because it allows us to have this comparison tool between before and after a specific test or it allows us to validate our expectations and if something changes because um, a product behaves in a, uh, differently than what we expect under a specific condition then we go back to the drawing board and we analyze why. We are really glad to see the way that Cooler Master approaches acoustics within their products. Um, it's really good to see that they really listen to their user base and that they really try to level the bar with each of their products. What we see a lot at other companies is that they have this trial and error process which um, usually just results in uh, unconscious competence, so basically they just get lucky. So that's why here at Sorama we have developed the acoustic design cycle, which is an iterative method in order to steer your acoustic design process and actually become consciously competent. So know where the sound is coming from, how it behaves and how you can actually solve the acoustic design issues. We work together with Cooler Master to help them build fans. They are quieter and more powerful at the same time. So how do they go from this to this? We give them insights, give them information on where does the bad sound, the bad vibrations come from. We can help you to look at all these peaks and then to find out what they are and then what can we do about it. With near view, uh, we can just select the peak and then, then we can just see what they are. Fans or, or any objects that they, they like to vibrate in all directions comes up and then goes down again and, and it all happens at very very small scales, it's, it's less than millimeters. These vibrations eventually uh, will resonate and then we end up hearing it. We should look into ways that can restrict these vibrations so that they could either come as like a stronger frame or, or tighter tolerances here and there to just make sure that the vibrations does not become as strong. And I think this could be something Cooler Master and Surama can work together to improve on in the next generations of the fan. Ultimately, the Surama Cam allows us to dig a bit deeper. If we get some a very specific feedback from our community or from a customer, we can easily recreate their situation, their environment, and their, uh, uh, their results and work uh, in an empiric way in order to find a solution. We do gather a lot of insights and at the end, the Surama Cam allowed us to create better products, more silent products, and the, the Silencio line of cases or the new SQL Flow fans are a product of this development that includes this tool.